the other day I came across this recipe. I think it was on Facebook, so I saved the picture. I have it here on my phone, which is this. Basically, it's healthy strawberries that taste like the candy Twizzlers. So you leave it three hours at 210 degrees. So we're gonna put it to the test and see if it's good. Today I bought these strawberries, they are fresh. I already washed them, so let's put it in the oven. So I already sliced all the strawberries, all the ones here on top, and if you can tell, I have one, two, three. I left three that I did not slice, just to see how this goes. <laughs> so it is exactly 12 p.m. So as we wait for the three hours for the strawberries to dehydrate, I think that's the right turn. We are going to talk about day skincare, which I have right here. So in case you don't know me, my name is Rosie and I have a vegan lifestyle. So that means that I only use products from brands that have not tested on animals and that they have no animal ingredients. So everything that you see here is cruelty free. And by the way, I hope you can hear me well. I was not going to turn on the fan, but it's so hot. I did put it a little away from me, so I hope you can hear me well. My skin had been doing so well. It wasn't until this morning when my skin got red here, the bottom, and my ear. It wasn't until I got the camera that it started to get itchy, but it had been doing really well. And by the way, maybe you already saw them in an unboxing video, which I get for free from the brands and I tend to give updates on my insta stories to see how they work let's start with two cleansers that I currently have I have glow recipe and what I like about this brand is how they use a specific fruit for each product and they match the color of that fruit for the bottle so this one we have the blueberry gentle cleanser and as you can see I have really used it and I can tell you that I love it it is gentle, it feels refreshing, it leaves my skin soft, so this is something that I do recommend. The other one that I have here is the Burst Gel Cleanser, and I have used it a little bit, but so far it's been good. Um, it has ceramides and rose water, and it feels gentle, so this one I like as well. I keep this one in the sink, and I keep the Glow Recipe in the shower, so I have it handy. To moisturize the skin, the one that I have here is first it's the gel cream this one has green extract and aloe leaf juice what i like about this one is that it's lightweight it's gel form so it feels really good under makeup it doesn't feel heavy so this one i like and it works really good now we have here the dark spot gel by burst and i have really noticeable dark spots three specific ones that i can show you this one here this one and this one and honestly i have not seen a difference i've tried other products but it feels like my dark spots are like really deep in my skin so this i have not seen a difference i have been using this for about two months and nothing <laughs> as far as skin protection i have this one also by burst it's spf 35 this is the daily mineral sunscreen this has c fennel moringa seed extract and what i like about this one is that it doesn't have that usual sunscreen smell it absorbs really well to the skin and it has like a pink tone it doesn't feel heavy this is something that i would buy it and if you follow me then you know how much i love rose water the one that i use is by altea and i just love this this is something that you can spray on your face on your hair and just mist it on it feels refreshing, especially for these hot days. 
it makes you feel in a better mood i just love the scent um the one that i get is from amazon and what i like about this brand is that the roses that they use is from bulgaria where that's supposed to be like where they have the best quality roses in the world so this is the brand that i use but you can even try boiling rose petals and save that in a bottle so you can use it too and something natural too that I have been trying and I saw this on TikTok this girl that she talked about her Korean grandmother how she was born in the 1930s and she is about 90 years old her skin looks incredible she barely has any wrinkles no dark spots it protected her from the sun and back then they didn't have all these skincare products so all they used was rice water and that's all she has been using throughout the year so I had to test it out and I have been trying this on little Lynn's face on myself she's 13 by the way and she gets some pimples around here but the results have been amazing like I see her skin more clear her acne is drying up like it's really good and the way that I apply it on the skin, I have these bamboo pads that I had on my Amazon wish list and my friend got for me. So basically, I just get the sweat and then I apply it on my skin. My skin feels so refreshed. It feels softer. I had some lines that were like noticeable here and here. I have noticed that they are less visible. So I keep this in the fridge and whatever I have left over, I also apply it on my hair. It's just really good. It's been one hour and this is how it looks like. It's been one hour, so let's keep on waiting. I'm ready I did my makeup I picked up my hair and it's a little dark outside it started raining like drizzling and now just to finish off everything the same rose water that I shared before I just like to spray it on and it just feels really good it just feels refreshing the lipstick that I have on my lips it's this one by Axiology color cinnamon and I think it's so pretty it's so beautiful so as far as my outfit of the day, this top that I have right now, it's from an eco-friendly brand. They make their pieces from wood and I really like that. My favorite part is the built-in bra. So you don't have to worry about putting like extra layers of clothing pieces. You just put it on and you're ready to head out. And I really like this neutral color. Um, it's available in more colors. And the pants, they are comfortable. It has elastic on the waist and they are loose from the bottom these are from amazon um sandals are also from amazon really comfortable my watch it's michael kors and this little earrings if you're in miami you can easily find them ross marshall's they come in in a set of three in a little box like for ten dollars these were from my amazon wish list that i got from my mom and that's basically my outfit of the day a nice outfit that's basic and comfortable <laughs> this is the second hour yeah it looks drier so one more hour to go <laughs> you've probably seen me wearing this like so many times but it's that comfortable and i really like it because it has the built-in pads the built-in bra i wish more tops would be like this so now we're going to talk about meditation what I have learned about the benefits, how I apply it, how I do it. Anyone can basically do meditation. A lot of times it's related to people who follow Buddhism, but anyone can do this. It has so many benefits. I already knew about meditation, but it wasn't until I read the book Think Like a Monk that I understood it better. In case you are in Miami, the way that I listen to audiobooks, I use the app Livy. So if you have a library card, you have access to the app for free. So that's what I love doing to save money and I don't have to spend money on books. So I either check out the books or I just listen to the audiobooks. 
So one of the benefits that I learned from Think Like a Monk when you meditate is that you look younger. These were studies that were done on people that have meditated for many years and they noticed that people that meditate for years, they look physically younger. So you know me. If there's anything about looking younger, naturally, I want to do it. I want to try it. Um, people don't tend to believe the age that I have. People say that I look younger. I'm not sure. Um, but anything that helps with looking younger, I want to do it. <laughs> so another great benefit is to be able to calm your mind. It, you know that it is challenging to quiet your mind. I mean, that's one of the biggest challenges to calm your mind. If you are able to calm your mind, you can apply the same way if you are around kids, if you're stuck in traffic, in many areas of your life. So those are a few of the benefits that the book mentions, but if you read the book, you will learn so much more. So now on with the tips. So as far as like for how long you should meditate, studies were done, this is mentioned in the book as well. The base time, the recommended base time, it's 20 minutes. You can start with less time, it can be 5 minutes, 10 minutes, but the base, it's recommended 20 minutes, it can be 30 minutes, 1 hour. If you do it for longer, it's even better. So as far as the position, the one that I like personally, it's sitting down. I don't like to recommend laying down because then you can fall asleep so it's better if you are sitting down that's what i prefer as far as the position the way that i learned i went to this place where they practice meditation and the way that they showed us is that you put your hands like this one on top of the other and your thumbs one on top of the other like that so then you just basically relax in a quiet place like i am right now so now that you have the right position, a quiet place, so now what do you do? So I do it in two ways. Either one, I just don't think about anything or I use it to think about certain goals. So the first method is simply to quiet your mind. Basically, you have to focus on the way that you breathe. Take a deep breath and let it out and just do it in a calm way. You can count like four seconds like count four seconds in hold it in for four seconds four seconds out like that and you keep repeating that and another good tip is that you can count up to 20 or longer and try not to think about anything if you think about anything then you start back at one and you start counting that's how i learn also another tip is that i like to think that i am floating i don't know how to explain it it's just this thing like like if i'm not in my body and that really helps me as well every time that you breathe it's through your nose only your nose not <laughs> try not to use your mouth only through your nose that's something i learned also from another book that i can talk about on another occasion just like that i put the timer on my phone or my apple watch not this one i have my watch somewhere else you can try to do this a couple of times a week and it feels so relaxing the benefits are so good i just love it So three hours pass by, let's try it. So here it is, this is a close up, um, so definitely not juicy at all, how I like fruit. We can definitely see like the liquid came out, so time for the taste test. I took a little pause, I had to pick up Lynn from summer camp, so I let this cool down, so this is moment of truth. I'm getting this one got stuck so here i have a piece mm. so i can tell you it tastes a little bit like gelatin mm. it's good now let's try this one that i did not slice mm. Ooh, the big one it's so good it almost feels like dessert it's juicy on the inside and it tastes really good one more it is so good so the slice one it's a little sour but if you leave it whole then it is sweet mm. <laughs> So thank you so much for spending a day with me on this blog about trying a new recipe my day skincare routine and meditation tips and i am so hungry so let's see what we eat you can follow me everywhere with the same name lynn sire if you have liked this video don't forget to give it a like i'll see you next time kisses bye
Thank you.